So I'm back again, and so is this shot, uh, which I think I've only used once before. I'm using it now because I'm eating cereal. And it's my day off today, well, one of my day offs, and so <laughs> I get to uh, uh, sleep in a little later and eat breakfast at 10.45. And like I've been talking a lot, a lot about work for the past few vlogs, uh, and it, it's just been going fine this past week. Uh, the, I think the only problem is uh, the hol holidays coming up. Uh, the the gas station I worked at uh, is open seven days a week, 24 hours a day, so uh, it will be open on Thanksgiving and Christmas. Someone has to work. Uh, I've worked on Halloween uh, th this past Saturday, which did, didn't really matter because I haven't gotten trick-or-treating since 7th uh, grade, I think. And then I worked 2 to 9, so I didn't get to hand out candy to any kids. But except at the store, uh, we gave out some toasty rolls to kids who came in. Which was nice, but you know, working on Halloween doesn't really matter. It's, but I would prefer not to work on Thanksgiving and Christmas, which I did last year when I was working at a movie theater, which is also open every day of the year so my next job I have to get uh, uh, work at a business that is closed on holidays yeah but yeah <laughs> that's what I need to get but the only problem is uh, my parents they have uh, timeshares, which <clears throat> which uh, they got from my grandparents. Uh, uh, my grandparents on my mom's side, when they passed away, they uh, inherited them, and now they uh, uh, sell them to other people. Or use them uh, themselves, and and you have to book them really early. So I think it was in August, and uh, now maybe even sooner, like June or July. Uh, my mom was booking timeshares for other people and she uh, actually heard about the timeshare in Mexico that that's where the, they usually are in Puerto Vallarta uh, and this one was for uh, at Christmas uh, a week uh, during Christmas So she actually jumped on that one and got it uh, for a week, and 
and we have all our uh, uh, plane tickets and reservations made. I think, I think we actually did that all before I got the job at uh, uh, my current job. So that's all done for. Uh, but you know, I told my boss about it, and he he seemed a little grumpy uh, about it because I am full time work. Uh, uh well full-time employee but I, I don't have any vacation time or sick leave because that's handed out at the beginning of the year and it's based on how much you've worked the previous year uh, um, so I currently have zero vacation time and sacred leave and like and when I uh well when I went back east to visit my aunt with was cancer uh he just scheduled around it so I I had a full week off But it, it didn't count as vacation time or sick leave, and that's that's probably what's gonna have to happen uh, with with Christmas. But but I uh, like he seemed a little grumpy that I was asking for another week off, <laughs> which, uh, which I, I told him my family normally stays around here for Christmas. Uh, but uh, like he said, uh, he normally asks for volunteers to work on Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's Eve and New Year's Day first. And then he planned out the schedule, so, uh, uh, like, I'm probably gonna, um, uh, volunteer to work on New Year's Eve and New Year's Day, which I also worked. Uh, last year, I was working the evening shift at the movie theater, so I was on, on the clock at midnight. That's how I cel uh, celebrated New Year's <laughs> by uh, closing the movie theater. But, but I'll volunteer to work those two days and and probably I'll just leave Thanksgiving up in the air. So it, if he schedules me to work Thanksgiving, then I'll have to. But... But, yeah, my parents said they'll just work Thanksgiving around my schedule, so whatever happens, they'll make it work. And, and I, like, I'll, I'll volunteer to work more before Christmas, uh, just to help them out, or, uh, help out more so I can get those days off because my boss he just said well I'll just see what I can do uh, 
because uh, I, I need someone here to run the store. I can't do it by myself. He says he works Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's every year because his children are all grown up and out, uh, out living somewhere else, so it doesn't really matter to him, but, uh, it's just bad timing because <laughs> everything's already scheduled. Uh, before everything was already scheduled before I uh, got this job that's the our bird clock going off it's it's 11 right now so uh, yeah yeah it's just bad timing and the, my boss he, he's a really nice guy but he, he gets a little grumpy sometimes like when there's a, a long line of people and and uh, only one person's at the cash register and then the person doesn't call for help That's when he gets a little grumpy, but uh, ho hopefully uh, everything will be okay. Yeah, I, I think I can make it work. I actually didn't intend this <coughs> vlog to to be about work again, but uh, uh, I guess I just got on that topic and had to keep going, which is actually what what people with autism do like they a lot of the times they'll become obsessive with just one topic like trains or cars or dinosaurs and just can't stop talking about it whereas with me i, I just can't stop thinking about something like work but uh, hopefully next vlog won't be about work. Yeah. Oh, and I, I actually had to come in early <coughs> a couple times last week. I think I might mention that because well, uh, one guy hurt his back lifting stuff and someone else was out, out sick. So we were shorthanded and, and I, I had to come in like a, an hour or two early. Whoa. Wow. One of our, uh, patio chairs just blew over. It's really windy out there, but Anyway, just to sum up, I'm hopeful I can get <coughs> the week off for Christmas. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll figure something out. How to make up for it. But anyway, uh, that's it for this vlog, and until next video, uh,
happy Halloween. <laughs> or even though I'm late, I'm like, happy November since it's the start of November. <laughs> Thank you.